my channel. So if you've been watching my videos lately, then you know that I recently moved here from Florida to Texas. And this is the state of my office. What a mess. I've been working out of my dining room table, which isn't so bad, but lately, anytime I want to find anything, it's like a nightmare. So I really wanted to get started on this disaster. I mean, you guys, it looks like an episode of Hoarders. How embarrassing. And two things. One, my mom is coming to visit from Florida. And two, I work from home. If you're watching this channel, you probably work from home too. So you can just imagine what a challenge it is honestly to have a room like this. I want my office back. So I'm gonna film it for you guys. It's gonna take me a couple of videos, this one and then another one, and then I'll do a big reveal. So you guys, before I go any further with this video, make sure you subscribe so that you can be notified when I upload those videos. Now, let's get to work. All right guys, so we're starting to clear the office out. We've made some headway. I can't believe how long it's taking us just to clear it out, but I wanted to give you like a quick little once over of where we're at. So at least we've cleared some space. Oh my gosh, I just don't know how I'm gonna fit everything back in here in an organized way. <laughs> but I know that I wanna clear this out completely so that I'm starting with a clean slate or at least as much as you know makes sense. I might leave a few little things, but I wanna be able to get everything out, rearrange the furniture, and get everything clean before I start organizing. This is definitely not gonna be a one day project. And not that I don't wanna motivate you guys, but y'all know that there's always the mess before the final ta-da. And this, you guys, is what my living room looks like. We still have our Christmas decorations up because we decided to tackle this first so that paint can be drying and I can be working on organizing things in my office and my husband can take over putting away Christmas stuff so oish and this is not even all of it all right guys so believe it or not this is my living room oh my gosh everything that was in that messy office is now in my messy living room but I think that you really need to work with an empty clean slate if you want to really, really get things organized. So this won't stay out here. This is just the ugly before the pretty. So this is my office. If it sounds echoey, it's because it's as empty as it's going to get for now. I have to put the cover on the couch. So we are vacuuming, by the way, with the world's best vacuum. If you've never heard of this vacuum, Probably no one has, I never had. World's most expensive and best vacuum right there, I'm telling you. Um, it's called a rainbow, by the way. Okay, so, emptied the office as much as possible. That wood box right there is really, really heavy because it's full completely with paper, um, printer paper. And there's my printer uh, and then my closet. And I didn't empty this yet because I just ran out of space in the living room. But it's as empty as I want to get it right now and we're just going to try to configure the furniture and see how it fits best in here. We're still painting the hutch. Who's we? My husband's doing it all. Uh, we're still painting the hutch that's going to go there. But I think it's going to look really nice and I just wanted to do a quick, quick check-in of how everything looks so far.
as you can see from the lighting, it was well into the night here and we were pretty exhausted. But we were making some headway. It just felt really good to finally just get to the point where I can even start cleaning my furniture. We got it into place. I'm cleaning it here with my Method Wood Oil. This is from Grove Collaborative. It is awesome, you guys. If you're not a member, I'll have a link below so that you can get a free gift um, from them. But my husband had to bring in the hutch even though he wasn't finished painting it because it threatened to rain. And then he was nice enough to put up my curtains even though he was exhausted. So that's it you guys, I'm going to end the video right here. Make sure that you're subscribed so that you can watch part 2 and then of course part 3 for the big reveal. Alright you guys, I'll see you in the next video.